Josh Duranek is still recovering after a boat explosion covered a quarter of his body with burns. Kimberly Red was in the boat with him. I think I've never heard anything blow that loud before. They were on their last pass around the lake on a friend's boat when the engine died. He let it sit for a minute or two and went to go start it back up and it exploded. The two were in the worst possible place at the worst possible time. We were actually sitting in the back seat. Right where the engine right, is. Right where the engine okay. and the gas compartments are. The blast tossed everyone on the boat in the water, but strangers sprung into action. Thankfully, there was a lot of uh, people that were willing to help out. Other boaters came by. Adam Gacky is a conservation officer with Iowa DNR. He says this trouble on the lake is a perfect reminder why you should always keep a fire extinguisher on your boat. A lot of that safety equipment was put into, uh, into effect this time to help another boater, not essentially your own boat. Um, I know of at least two other boats that did use their fire extinguishers to help extinguish the flames. And for that, this couple is thankful. While they can't take back the timing of the trip on the water, as Josh sat in the hospital, he knew the timing was right for something else. The two got engaged this past week. That was my wake up, you know. I've got the one right here in front of me.